This is day 5 on Royal Caribbean Harmony of the Seas, and today we are at the port Costa Maya. Today was a perfect day to be at Costa Maya. The sun was out and the place felt very tropical and touristy. This is one of the bigger ports. There was a total of three ships here. When you arrive, you must walk through the port shops to enter. And also a reminder, you cannot bring food off the ship into the ports. We saw people having to surrender their food. When you enter the port, you are greeted with a traditional Papa Lamp Flyer dance. The 20 minute dance includes five men which climb a 75 feet pole. We learned the purpose of this dance was initially to please the mountain god, to find forgiveness and give thanks. When the time is right, the five men will fly around the pole downwards while playing music. Pretty impressive. Here, take a look. The presence of the army really made the environment feel safer. We also found out there is a pool here, but we weren't ready for it, and this vacation is a cruise. We have pools on the ship. This made it feel like a Mexico resort. It also kind of felt like a zoo. We got to see flamingos and then dolphins. Golden Retrievers of the Ocean, Dolphins. The opportunity to swim with dolphins felt surreal and even safe since it's inside an enclosure. Now the trainer is preparing the dolphins for the guests. You can swim and take pictures with them. It's part of an excursion package pricing roughly 180 USD. Look at this, we are at the Mexico Coastal Maya right now and I just saw this beautiful building or beautiful structure and it looks really nice. We got some pictures here. It's really hot here but so far Coastal Maya has been very nice. There's a lot of animals, dolphins, music, it's alive, cool port. At this point, my family had enough of this port and went back to the ship. As for myself, I kept exploring.
We are now heading back towards the ship. I find it very humbling every time I walk beside a cruise ship. Modern day cruise ships are like a theme park. They have everything you can ask for and having all that on a moving vessel feels so humbling. I enjoy each moment I'm near a ship and have tons of fun recording my adventures. Today, we have a MSC, Royal Caribbean, and a British cruise line, Morella, docked at port. The combined addition increases Costa Maya's population by over 15,000 souls. So we're now back on the ship after the port Costa Maya. Now let's go get some food at Windjammer. Jammer. Here just having some lunch. Later at like 12:30, there's a beanbag toss competition. Let's see how that goes. At 1:30 or something, there's a soccer shootout. At three o'clock is our tree. A lot of activities today. Let's come along. Now let's go to the soccer shootout competition. We just finished the beanbag competition and now we have the soccer competition. It's also very hot in here, so I'm really looking forward to going ice skating to cool down. Now it's time for a soccer mini game. I almost got first and a medal, but just shy by one point. Let me explain the scoring system. We all shoot from three corners and you get one point for scoring, two for touching the side poles, and three for the top pole. Let the games begin. Went, now it's my dad's turn. Oh, he missed. So if you hit the bars, the poles, it's two points the side, the upper bar is three, and the net's one. So that's my dad's turn. Let's see. He's going for a second shot. You get three shots. Oh, that's the pole. That's two points right there. He hit the pole, so that's two points. He's going for his third and last shot. Now let's see. You want to hit the top because that's three points. The wind's blowing the ball. All right, his last shot. Oh, too high, too high. <laughs> so my dad got two points. I got six, but we get two rounds, so I think they add the accumulate your points. So I think it's round two soon. This kid in the orange is really good. trying to take us out. So round two, they move the cones further back. So we have to shoot from a longer distance, but the stakes are higher now. So we got in, it's three. Poles are five, top is six. Oh, so close. One more. 
My dad's at two points from the last round, so the max he can get is eight if he hits the top. Oh, is it in? Oh, nice try. This is how the flow router looks like when it's not in operation. Right now we're still at Costa Maya and I just want to show you guys the view here. Below us we have Aqua Theater. Man, the ocean is so wide. So there's three ships here right now. There was an MSC ship and I don't know the name of this ship but it's not a common one. It's not like the main cruise lines. If any of you guys know what ship this is, there's the logo right there. Let me know. I'm not sure what that name is. They have a really nice sports court here. It's like a basketball court with nice flooring. I'm kind of jealous. I think their court is better than the court we have in Harmony of the Seas. Wow. And over there you have MSC Seaside. You see this very long walk path. That's the path we had to take um, after we went off the ship to go to the port. And over there, there was actually a lot of things to do. You could swim with dolphins. There was a lot of shops, a lot of food places, and it looked very scenic there. We're now at the solarium. They have a pool here too. I didn't know they had a pool in here. This pool's in a pretty good spot. It's quiet in here too. So I've located the helipad and I want to figure out how do I get there so I can get closer to the ships and a better view. So let's go try to figure out how we get there now. And that's the MSC ship. Other ships I have been on, the helipad is open to the public. But unfortunately, this helipad was locked off. After realizing that, I went to Central Park and grabbed a delicious snack. The beauty of Central Park is that they have live plants and melted sandwiches, which are even better when toasted. The scenery creates an illusion that makes you feel that you're at a park on land. Our cafe and I got a sandwich. I got them to press it because it tastes way better. And we got a fruit punch. And as I was saying before, I couldn't find the helicopter pad. So that's really unfortunate. I was gonna go there and take a video of the MSC ship because it's way closer. Couldn't find it. I walked for like 20 minutes. I gave up. Now we're just enjoying some food at Central Park. I got the food from Park Cafe. Very nice here. It feels like you're not even on a ship. It feels like you're outside. You got live greens. You have birds over here. I like this vibe. Let's enjoy. We got some more sandwiches. Round two. So this one here is, I think, uh, a portal belt mushroom and cheese. Let's try it out. Oh yeah, that's good. And this one here is a tuna melt. I love it when it's pressed because it's crunching the inside, warm on the outside, inside, crunching the outside. Oh yeah, that's good too. But I think the tuna melt, it's a little bit too filling. I wish it was thinner and less tuna. Because when I take a bite, it's a little bit, it's quite a lot. But still very good. And the fruit punch. Guys, don't make Emery angry. You know what happened, you know what will happen. Now me dash conform me.
Ladies and gentlemen, the moment that everyone is waiting for. This is the finals between Emery versus Logan. Another fun activity, archery. Today, we had an archery tournament and the winner of the round robin takes home a gold medal. The competition included roughly 40 participants ranging from all ages. After some stretching, that commenced the Hunger Games. Katniss Everdeen, District 12. Two on the same rag. He knocked it off. He knocked it off. But it was bullseye. It was a bullseye that fell off. There's a bullseye on the bullseye. Yeah. There's a bullseye on camera. There's a bullseye. That fell off. Oh, it's there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Oh. Emory goes to the next round. Woo! Good job, guys. That's super cool. <laughs> Break, you didn't see that. And then, because if mine fell off, whatever, yeah. I would have lost. That was tight. Nail blade. It's okay, we have video Jackie, replay. Nietzsche, yeah. ready? Let's begin. Okay, Bullseye! Oh! Bullseye! Emery? Oh! oh. From Bullseye! Nice! Oh! oh. Emery! Just wait, 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 just wait, wait. One more, one more, one more. Emery, please have mercy. <laughs> Guys, don't make Emory angry. You know what happened? You know what will happen? Alright, so we just finished some archery competition. I made it to the finals and I was feeling pretty good until I burst that guy over there. He got five bullseyes in a row. I was hoping to make at least one mistake because I start off with a mistake. Oh my. That guy's good. Well deserved win. That was a real competition indeed. Oh. Now we're going to go slide down the ultimate abyss to take a shortcut down to the sixth floor, go to the fifth for guest service, and sign up for ice skinny again. The original plan was to take the Ultimate Abyss down to go to the reception and then go to the ice skating to sign up. But we saw that no one was lining up for the zip line, so we seized the opportunity and took a ride. Yeah, this is the second time doing it. It's not as scary as you think, but there's no lap today, so I just want to try it again. Kind of fun. 
We're at the golf course right now. We just finished zip lining. And would you look at this view? Look at the sky. It's like cotton candy clouds with those colors. It is so nice right now. And we have the ocean behind us. This is just so nice. But now we're gonna go to guest services and ask them if you can make a reservation for ice skating. So let's do that. We're now in the Alton Abyss and we're about to slide down. See you guys there. They're going now. We'll show you guys when we get down there. I right, just passed by the pizza shop and I gotta do my pizza tax. Look at this. After I eat this, we're gonna go to table tennis tournament and then ice skating. So that's really eventful. So we signed up for table tennis tournament again today, tournament number two. And we're looking over this view again. Harmony of the Seas, we have the ultimate abyss slides, we have the carousel there. Let's play some table tennis. Right after that, we're going skating. Just finished ice skating at Studio B. If you recognize, this is the stage yesterday where we watched 1887 performance, and that was spectacular. This is a really fun session, but now we're gonna go change the area for dinner. I haven't looked at the menu yet, but I'm very excited. The, menu, the food's always amazing on the cruise. Skating was very fun. I can't wait to skate more once I get home. And let's move on. All right, now we're back from skating and table tennis. Let's get changed and go eat dinner. Let's go. I have my first main course, some smoked crispy salmon. You can smell that it's been smoked. Now let's try. Oh, <laughs> My second entree came uh, steaks, Mexican style. Let's try this out. Try the rice. I like the rice, but it's pretty filling. The flavor is nice. It has some veggies. <clears throat> the veggies are good. The beans, I'm gonna skip. I don't like beans. Honestly, this dinner was one of the best in all the 10 cruises I have been on. 
extremely juicy salmon, and thin, effortless steak. After dinner, we went to Royal Promenade to explore the nightlife. We took shots of the day, played some games, and checked out the closing shop sale. We just went to the shop and got our shot of the day. I got this creamy liquor it, and apparently it's from Africa. It tasted really good. And now we came out here, we see some beer pong set up. The perfect combination. Oh, you soak it in. Nothing? You soak yeah, it in. Nothing in there? Oh, there's nothing. You should have taken the table, bro. What if I go in there? Oh, oh. oh yeah. Can I do it like this? Ping pong? Ping pong. And beer pong. Oh, where'd you get this from? It's from home. Oh. Canada. <laughs> I like this one. You like the pong? No, we do not these. These are good. You can cook the I know we already watched the fine line aqua show, but I just had to watch it one more time. And when the food is included and open 24 hours, I also had to eat a late night snack before bed. So we just finished watching the fine line show in Naga Theater. Now some late night desserts. And today was a very fun day at Costa Maya, our second port. Tomorrow we're gonna go to our third port, also in Mexico. Um, but yeah, we'll show you that tomorrow. Today is a fun day. Tomorrow's gonna be even a funner day with lots of activities. And yeah, see you guys later. Cheers. Cheers. Drink it. Oh, no, don't do me a hooligan. You, don't pass out.